That's why you really can't pay attention to the rankings too much. Mm -hmm. But heading over to Troop, where the Carlisle Indians visited the Tigers. It was a pretty good one. I will say, my, say, say so myself. First home game of the season without Cooper Reed, but the team still supported him. And as you can see, there his jersey is on the bench. And the Tigers making a bold move in. The first quarterback, Grayson Heron, throwing parallel to Trey Davis. Davis throws downfield where even our cameraman gets lost. Where is he? Bryce Wallen now with the ball and walks it off to the end zone. Tigers leading and dominating the quarter. Heron and finds Kobe Turner in the crowd, trust him, and Turner pulls through for another touchdown. Carlisle first and only touchdown of the quarter. Here comes Clayton Hart hugging the sidelines and an easy walk to the end zone. I don't even think he got touched on that play at all. But Tigers again whoop the ball. Heron scanning the field and finds Trey Davis running. Davis catches the ball and almost drops it, but he hugs it tight. He's a good football player. Look at him. High kneeing into the end zone. Now let's see that final score. Okay. okay. <laughs> see what I'm saying? Carlisle number six, Troop 52. I mean, I, I mean Troop might make the biggest jump in the Fab 15 polls for week for three. For sure. We saw the big win in the season opening. Yep. 80 over White Oak. And now yeah. 52 over Carlisle to 15. And that guy right there, Trey Davis, just makes it happen.